Hey, so I'm Louise O'Brien, I'm owner of Biodox Fitness, for those of you who don't know me. Uh, so I used to do vlogs back in the day and I just stopped because life just got busy. So with the pandemic and everything that's going on, I have a little bit more downtime. So I decided to get back on the vlogs. So this is the first one back in a long time. So hey, <laughs> welcome back. Today I'm going to talk through three main points today. So this is my first vlog, vlog, vlog. This is my first vlog back in absolute ages. Today is going to be focused on three major points. So today is going to be mind, body and soul. Tipping into like the mind and ways to keep your mind active over there the next few weeks of lockdown I know everyone can find it physically and mentally challenging so we'll be hitting in on some ways to keep your mind active um, and then as well then you have body so we'll be looking at some exercises we'll be looking at some nutrition aspects and also then just uh, fun ways to keep active and then that brings us to soul so just things that you like to do things that you enjoy doing for no other reason but it just brings a smile to your face brings a bit of uh, light to your heart so that brings us to this morning which is um, myself on the one wheel so I really think um, since lockdown I've seen a couple of people kind of going back to their childhood and getting out skipping ropes and like rollerblades and roller skates and skateboards and I absolutely love seeing this and I think um, more people should be doing this. We shouldn't be afraid of what people are going to say, oh my god there's that 33 year old going down on her one wheel. Life is too short, do things that bring you joy and that's what I started off my day with today. So welcome to episode one of um, my vlog. to get on the one wheel so I haven't been really able to get on it uh, during the week this week so I'm gonna make a bit of time uh, get up early either Saturday or Sunday and get a long spin on it and um, so yeah we're going down early because it's less likely to be busy so more people won't see me if I fall so a one wheel is kind of like an electric skateboard but you have to balance the board out but the one thing about the, the one wheel is you don't have to push uh, to keep it moving so you just lean forward and it moves for you so it's good for like longer distances and it's really good for uh, like your core and your legs because I, I tell you after a few minutes you'll feel it and um, so yeah and it's just a bit of fun really Sunrises, sunsets. Sunrise, because like it's the start of a fresh day. Anything is possible. Sunsets, kind of like that's it then. The end. Just down here by the riverside, uh, using the, the one wheel. It has been a little while since I had a chance to take this out for a test drive. So I'm going to make it a bit of a priority to get out the weekend. Ooh, that's fresh. This kid's up in the, up in the thing drinking up there. They're shouting down potatoes at us. They're drinking up in that little... That right there. They're shouting down potatoes at us. What's that mean? How do they know I love potatoes? <laughs> <laughs> Are we going to the gym? Yeah. We love going to the gym. So as I said, I started my morning off with the one wheel uh, just for a bit of fun and um, to start my day off with something that I enjoyed. So I do... Um, I kind of dare you to do something that you did as a kid and see does it still bring you the same joy as an adult or maybe even to try something new that you never thought you could have done or that you're maybe a, bit, a little bit too old to actually get into. I dare you to do it for the next nine weeks. It's a challenge for you. Do it. Award winning facility. Okay, welcome to the gym. Make sure to please sanitize your hands. I'll do it for you. There you go. Okay, come on in. So this is the gym. Now I'm in the game. I was on the bench. On the bench. First I was renting. Now I'm collecting rent. Run it up. First it was the beamer. Now uh, we may or may not have served alcohol here for when um, member parties were a thing. Inside here we have the mostly dumbbells and benches area. We have the TV there, so you can try on YouTube or whatever you want to blast out there. Um, as you can see, a lot of the shelves are bare because we gave our members a lot of the equipment to keep them motivated and going over the lockdown. We have ski yards, this is kind of like the leg area. 
leg press, leg curl, leg extension, 60 squat, loads of room for walk and lunges. Then this is another upper body area. We have our primal kit here. So the likes of your rows, lat pull down, tricep extensions, all those jazzes. Then here then we have the, the boxes. So usually we'd set up and have like our classes here, our strength and conditioning classes, so there's loads of room for people to grab dumbbells and barbells and use all those. And then the back ball then, we have our rig. So three bay rig, we have the extenders for rope climbs and for like hanging abs and ring rows and all that. Then at the top up here, we have our concept two rowers, prowler, astro turf area, battle ropes, air bike, uh, and just loads of space. So as you can see upstairs we built the MMA area because I started doing, doing um, BJJ just before lockdown hit so I was getting really into that so I put a matted area. All the boxing bags and all are up there so that's like brand spanking new ready to, to rock when the members can come back in so that's upstairs. Um, so yeah this is my happy place, welcome. Cody! Hey! Jesus Cody that's the second one this week. So now I'm gonna do my workout. Today is a full body day on Saturday, so I'll be hitting a little bit of everything today. Hey, Bill, I'm in the mood for a switch up. I hit the function, hit the rose right till I hiccup. I hit the stage and leave with money that say stick up. She picks a perfect, so I told him I'm a flicker. Bill, I'm in the mood for a change up. I leave the city and return with my change up. They got amnesia, don't remember how they played us. And now for my favorite part, the air bike. They wanna knock me down, but somehow I just stay up. So that was episode one. I have dusted off the cobwebs. I got back on board, did the vlog and it's done. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, you know what to do. Hit that like button, subscribe to get notifications then when I have my next vlog out. Definitely going to be doing the vlog each week, definitely for the next nine weeks. And then we'll take it from there. So yeah, thanks for watching and have a great day.